Hey beauties, what's going on? Welcome to my channel, Silence of Beauty. Let beauty enter your world. Okay guys, I'm super excited about this video right here. Um, I think in my last vlog, I posted um, that I went to the Estee Lauder MAC warehouse sale um, here in Toronto and um, I picked up some goodies. Um, and I also picked up a few other things that weren't under the Estee Lauder umbrella. Um, I did go to Bath and Body and picked up a few things. So I'm going to share all that things with you. And if you stay to the end of the video, I did pick you guys up a little goodie. So there will be a giveaway and I'm going to talk a little bit about that a little later on. So if you're interested in seeing all these things that I got for myself, I mean, I haven't bought myself anything in a while. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up for myself, then stay tuned because the haul is coming up next. Okay guys, so let's get on to the haul. So like I said, I went to the Estee Lauder um, MAC warehouse sale last weekend and I picked myself up a few goodies. Um, so all the brands that are under Estee Lauder umbrella like MAC, Smashbox, Bobbi Brown, Estee Lauder, Clinique, um, you had Donna Karen, you had Michael Kors, you had Coach. Um, there was just an array of brands under Estee Lauder. Like I didn't even know you had Argin, which is a really good skincare um, line. So there was a bunch of stuff, but I picked up a few things and um, I'm gonna share them with you. So one of the first things I picked up, I really wanted some glitter. And I had been going to Sephora looking for um, glitters or glitter pens or whatever the case may be for the looks that I wanna do in my Deck the Hall series. Um, so, like when I got there, I ended up seeing these. Were, this was one of the first things I seen, and I decided to pick it up. I purchased um, this right here, and this is probably from an old collection, I'm guessing. And um, it's just it has glitter and pigments, and I thought it was amazing. And I paid twenty five dollars for this. And you get three pigments and two glitters, and I was just like, oh, I have to have it. So I got this. Um, I should probably take this stuff out if it's gonna be okay y'all I wasn't gonna struggle trying to take this out on camera so um, these are the pigments right here um, the first one I got is reflect gold and it's just a glitter and it has like it's like a silverish glitter with um, golden reflex in it oh, so I can't wait to use this this is the reason why one of the reasons why I got this because of this um, glitter pigment thing right here love it gorgeous okay um, the second the pigment that I got this one is old gold which is beautiful I cannot wait gorgeous um, I got this glitter and this is called 3d gold it just has a bunch of colors in it it's really pretty and then I got this pigment, which is called Deep Blue Green. Gorgeous. So pretty. And then the last one I got in the set is Just Before Dawn, which is like a really pretty kind of brownish type of um, pigment. It's really pretty. So I got those five. And then, as if that wasn't enough, I picked up three glitters. And this one, oh my gosh, there was so much. I really wanted that red glitter. Um, I really, really, really wanted it. But I'm thinking like what I could get the most use out of, and I'm probably never going to use it after that look. So I was just like, let me get something that I know I'm going to use. So I picked up this um, glitter right here, and this is light blue it is so gorgeous y'all like it's so pretty and these were twelve dollars you see that look at that oh 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 how i just i cannot wait i swear to you this will be a part of the holiday series the look i have to use this this is gorgeous i love this so i got light blue and then I went ahead and I got um, Reflex Rust. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, like it's so gorgeous. 
Oops. Look at that, y'all. I even gotta swatch this one because it's just it's it's so pretty. Look at that. Oh my god, it's so pretty. I love this. Um, it's like a rusted color, and I just think it's so pretty. Oh, I don't don't get all over my table, please. So I picked up Rust Reflect Rust, which I thought was a really beautiful color. And it's so finely milled, so this is it, and it's really pretty. And then the last one I picked up, which is gorgeous, and honestly, it's my favorite one, is Reflex um, Purple Duo. And this right here was the, like, this is the holy grail for me. It's, like, so gorgeous. Like, it is the prettiest color like ever look at that oh my goodness y'all look at that I'm gonna try to swatch it on my hand for you guys over here oh look at that color oh so pretty so those were the glitters and pigments that I picked up and then I picked up a few, one MAC lipstick and three lip glosses. I don't even remember what collection this was a part of, but um, if you guys know the collection that this was a part of, let me know, because I have no idea. Um, maybe the Aqua, I don't even know. Let me not even try to butcher it. But I picked up two, um, three lip glosses and one lipstick. So I've been dying, and the lipsticks were $10. So I've been dying to get my hands on this. I got Smoked Purple, yeah, Smoked Purple. Been dying to get my hands on this, and this is what it looks like. It could almost come off looking black, um, depending on you know the undertones of the skin, but it's so beautiful. I've seen so much people wearing it, and of course, I had to get it myself. And this is a swatch of it right here. It's so gorgeous. And I will be using it. And I'm so excited for my Smoke Purple. Yes. So I picked up Smoke Purple. And then I just picked up um, Just Superb Cream Glass. And I've had this before. I just got a next one. It looks like this. This is like a nice baby pink kind of color really pretty so just superb and then I got um, peach stock which I'll show you guys quickly what that looks like so peach stock kind of like a peachy cream color and I'm just gonna do a small swatch here and it's really light, but um, the reason why I got it is because um, it will help me lighten up lipsticks or just the center to do that kind of ombre 3D kind of lips. So I got that. And the last one that I picked up is called Modern Lore. And it was just, it was so pretty. I couldn't even pass it up. I just thought it was gorgeous. And it's just this kind of purple color and it has like glitter it's so pretty if I could get it open okay so this is want to open up for me but yeah this is it it's super 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 pretty gorgeous love it so those were the lip glasses glosses cream glasses that I picked up and then um I also picked up this Estee Lauder double wear stay in place gel eyeliner now I didn't know what it was I didn't know if it was a gel liner I didn't know if it was whatever but I picked it up and it's just it's like it's called um extreme emerald yeah do you see this it's like the prettiest color ever I'm gonna swatch it just a little bit it's super pigmented look at that I'm going to place that right here. Look at that. 
isn't that like the prettiest thing you've ever seen it's so pretty so I had to get that and this was like I think eight dollars or nine dollars whatever so pretty I had to get this so I got this Estee Lauder extreme emerald gel liner gorgeous and um the last thing am I finished yeah so this is one of the last things that I picked up and this is probably my ex most exciting purchase um, is the Smashbox Studio Pop eye palette and um, I got this for 35 I think and it's just gonna open up for me or am I gonna be struggling okay got it so this is what it looks like it's like those book oh, upside down this is what it looks like so sleek and nice and um, it's like a book of shadows type of thing so you open it up like so you have a mirror you have these plastic little protective things and then on the side you have um, how to create some eye looks and then you have this plastic covering on it and when you open it up When you open it up, sorry guys, when you open it up, you have 20 beautiful eyeshadows. Like, I kid you not, look at these colors. Let me hide that, let me show you that. Look how gorgeous this is. Like, do you see this? It's like the prettiest thing, like look at these colors. They're super pigmented. Um, I'm going to go ahead and swatch this blue right here. Look at that. Let me place that here. Let me just swatch a few colors. Um, this purple is really pretty. So pretty. And then maybe this gold because everybody always likes to see gold, right? Okay. They're super pigmented just by the little swatches that I did. Look at that super pigmented you get 20 eyeshadows like you could you can't go wrong like I'm so excited to play in this palette like I couldn't pass it up and for the price regular price is a $50 palette I think it's $50 um, yeah so it was $50 palette with a value of 200 so I couldn't pass it up it was $35 I thought it was a great steal and um, I got the Studio Pop, Smashbox Studio Pop palette. Okay, and as a free gift, um, they were giving at the door um, this Estee Lauder Scrumptious Two Tone One Eye Opening Mascara, and you get a dual mascara. One side is black, which I actually really do like this wand. So you can see the wand right here. I really do like it. Um, so you get black on one side and on the other side you get a brown which I thought was really cool so um, I ended up getting one my mom got one with the purchases that she got but my mom, wore, no, my mom doesn't wear mascara so I ended up taking it for myself so I got two of those um, so now I'm gonna move on to the other things that I purchased I did a quick stop at Sephora and I was actually looking for glue adhesive instead of using my um, Instead of using, what do I always use? My dual glue. Um, so when I went there, I ended up seeing the um, lit holographic um, lit kit. So I purchased one. And this, I think, was like $20. And it just comes, I don't even want to open it. But it just comes with the really, really pretty glitter and the glitter adhesive. And I purchased that at Sephora, and this was like 20 bucks. So that was the thing that I purchased from Sephora. Um, I'm going to move on to other cosmetics that I purchased. And these are like drugstore. But I'm going to show you anyways. So I went to the drugstore, and I wanted to purchase a few things. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the lipsticks that I purchased. I purchased these two lipsticks, and these are from NYC. And this color is Air Kiss. It's just a really pretty pink color. That's it right here. And they're really creamy. 
and that's it right there it's such a beautiful color I love that I purchased air kiss and then of course I purchased a nude and this one's called creamy caramel gorgeous it's just like the such a pretty nude and this is what that looks like I'll do a swatch I can't, I can't even and that's it right there it's just like the perfect nude right here so pretty so I purchased those two colors um, for lipsticks and I purchased that at Walmart and then I went ahead and I got my wet and wild I was actually looking for a dark brown because that's what I use on my eyebrows um, but they didn't have it so they had mint brown I don't know if this is gonna be too dark so I went ahead and I got the NYC Cool Brown Brow and Eyebrow Pencil. And um, this is dark brown. So hopefully that this works. It looks like it will be good because it's not so dark. So I'll try the both of them and figure out which one I like. But I just picked up these. And then for the whole entire weekend, I've been looking at the new L'Oreal Infallible Never Fail. Um, silky pencil eyeliners and I'm actually wearing the blue one today so as you can see I opened it these I've been passing them up and down they have a teal color which is gorgeous which I think I'm gonna go back and get and they have kind of like a pinkish champagne color but I got um, cobalt blue and I got pure purple and I'm actually gonna just open finish opening up the blue and swatch it for you it's gorgeous I'm actually wearing it today I couldn't help it. So I'm just going to swatch it right here. For you guys to see it. Look at that color. I mean. Yo, this little thing was $10, but it's worth it. And I picked up the purple, which I'm so excited to use. Oh. So I picked up that. Um, and then I just picked up two palettes. I picked up the Hard Candy. I don't even know what it is. This is called Top 10 trendsetter eyeshadow collection and it's just a glitter pretty much a glitter shadow I just purchased this and this was like five bucks I think it has a lot of glitter in it but it would be I think a lot of these colors would be really pretty on the lid so I purchased that who knows if I'm gonna use it but I purchased it anyways and um, I know I'm late but I finally purchased the nudes Maybelline palette I've never picked it up um, I always keep on looking at it and passing it, so I decided to get it, so I will do a look showing you guys from this palette right here. So those are the things that I picked up at the drugstore, and I also purchased these um, hard candy little big shadows, and I purchased six. I purchased six of these. I'll just show you one. I'm not going to go through everything, but... So it looks like this. They're like big shadows. And they're really nice. So I picked up six of these. And this color is gorgeous. I really like this color. It's so pretty. Really pigmented. It's just a pretty color. And I swatched that right there. So it's a really pretty color. So I picked up the big eyeshadows. And I picked up six of these. Okay. So that's it for makeup. I'm going to move along to Bath and Body because I really want to get to the giveaway and I don't want this video to be super duper. Okay, so moving along to Bath and Body Works. Um, I swear to y'all, this is like my new addiction. So I ended up going to Bath and Body Works and they had a really nice sale on the items. They're like their um, hand soaps, their candles, blah, blah, blah. And I ended up picking, I ended up picking up six candles. They were 30% off, which is a really good buy. So the first candle I'm going to show you is this one right here. Love it! Um, this is the Vanilla Snowflake. And who doesn't like the smell of vanilla? I love the smell of vanilla. I have candles in the back here and they're all vanilla. I love the smell of vanilla. So I got this one and I just I love it. It's not overly strong, um, but it's just such a nice, sweet not overly sweet but just a nice scent it's it's I love the scent so I got um, vanilla snowflake and then I got um, hot buttered rum 
and I love this. They had butterscotch something, um, but that was a little bit stronger. So I decided to go with this one that was kind of like a similar scent, but it wasn't as strong. And this is hot buttered rum. OMG. <laughs> I swear, if you can't tell me I'm not obsessed, then something's wrong. And this has got to be one of my favorite scents. I've already started burning it. This right here, and um, this is the Marshmallow Fireside. This right here is just so warm and cozy. Like, as soon as I enter the house, I, I start bringing this. It's just... Ugh. It's so cozy. Like, I posted a picture on Instagram, um, and the caption was like, a warm, cozy um, candle with a good read and some nice tea is like the best unwinder and this really does it for me it really does help me to relax and unwind and I just I love it I got two of these I'm, I love it that much and um, I went ahead and I got Mary cookie and this is just like baked goods and I, I'm gonna be burning this on Christmas morning because I love it it smells like you're baking and I love the smell of cookies so I love this one and this is part of their holiday scent so if you haven't grabbed that if you haven't grabbed this one go ahead and grab that if you like the smell of that stuff and then this one is the cinnamon caramel swirl and it's exactly what it sounds like it has a cinnamon caramel smell to it which I love the smell of caramel, so that's that. So those are the ones that I got. I got two of the Marshmallow Fireside, so I have two of these. So I didn't bother showing it, but those are what I got from, um, that's what I got from Bath and Body. And I absolutely love it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, y'all. So those are all the things that I purchased from the Estee Lauder Mac Warehouse Sale the drugstore and bath and body works. So um, let's get on to this giveaway. So of course, I couldn't just think of myself. I thought about you guys as well. And um, I know I said that I was gonna do a giveaway when I got back, so here it is. This is my own personal giveaway. This is not a collaboration with any company. Um, everything purchased was with my own money. <laughs> so I really wanted to give back to you guys who have been following me, supporting me. Um, from time the old and the new so this is for you guys so I've got a bag full of goodies here so there's going to be two winners um this is I'm gonna call this giveaway out with a bang yes out with a bang um to round to round up the year and to start your collection off with um, new things so out with a bang that's going to be the name of this contest and um, the first thing that I went ahead and did is I purchased you guys one of the Smashbox Studio Pop eye palettes, so the same one that I have. So, yeah. uh, sorry guys. So here's mine and this one will be for you guys. So the first place winner will win this palette um, and the second place winner will win this Fashion Fair um, eyeshadow and lip palette. Two lipsticks, two of the same lipsticks that I showed you from NYX. They'll win, let's see, four of the um, hard candy baked eyeshadows. So the second place winner will win these and the first place winner will win the studio pop. okay so definitely check the description box for all the rules and regulations for this giveaway I may forget to mention it in the video so definitely check the description box so you know what's going on um, so for this giveaway um, obviously you must be a subscriber to my channel I mean you have to be a subscriber to my channel. Um, you must be the, over the age of 18. If you are under, you can still participate in the giveaway. You just need your parents' permission. Um, so yeah, 
You must be over the age of 18. In the comments box, in the comment box, all I need you to do is um, tell me at least one of the items that you would like and what you would do with that look if you did win. And um, I want you guys to follow me on Instagram. And all you have to do on Instagram is just under, I'm going to have these pictures of the things that I'm giving away. Under that picture, just say enter me and um, leave your YouTube name so I could go ahead and check you guys and follow you out. So all you have to do is um, comment below and just tell me one out of the products out of the giveaway you want and what you do with it. And on my Instagram, on my Instagram, which the link will be here and it will be in the description box, just on the photo, say enter me and just put your YouTube name and that's it. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this giveaway. I really wanted to do something really nice for you guys and give back for those of you guys who have been supporting me from day one. Um, and there will be more giveaways to come. So stay tuned and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.